What's up, YouTube? No Lapos here. Just want to do, uh, throw a quick little shout out there to uh, the Atheist Antidote. <laughs> the Atheist Antidote. He is uh, inoculating us daily against faith. I don't know what the purpose of his antidote is, if he's trying to uh, trying to stop people from becoming atheists or what, but he is not helping that cause at all. He is uh, demonstrating daily just the depths that a person can sink to when they feel that their ideology is being uh, being easily refuted. <laughs> um, you know, he's uh, he's creepy. He's uh, condescending. He is willfully ignorant, and he is a liar. Whether it's intentional or not, he's lying. Um, and that really just reconfirms my prejudices against creationists that I try not to have. But every time I watch one of these goddamn videos, uh, it's certainly certainly not helping anyone get faith. Let's just put it that way. It's certainly not, uh, not making me think twice about whether evolution is real. <laughs> Any more than uh, any more than Nephilim free gets me to think of whether the Earth is really round or not. And speaking of which, uh, there was some peer-reviewed article he mentioned about uh, the Earth being flat. So uh, I'd like to see that, and uh, I'd like to see him show that he's not really a goddamn liar because um, Pythagoras showed that the Earth was spherical uh, about 500 BC, and uh, modern peer-reviewed science came about in. Uh, in about the 1617, maybe 1800s, really got solidified. So, uh, so what is that peer-reviewed article about flat Earth? Let me show you that one. Maybe you can uh, show that you're not just pulling everything you say completely out of your ass. All right, uh, loving you guys.